good news for sure. Well, the pandemic is proving to be a very difficult time for families and first responders all across Metro Detroit, but sometimes just a very small gesture goes a long way. Our Carolyn Clifford joins us now with a very special update. Carolyn. Oh, you're so right about that, Alan. We want to give you an update on the story about an Ann Arbor woman who just wanted to say thank you to some of the first responders with a very small gesture. Well, that gesture has now blossomed into a way to help those who are suffering during this pandemic. Susan Schmidt has a giving heart. This former teacher for children who are disabled was watching healthcare workers leaving U of M's cancer center when the pandemic was first hitting Michigan. And I could see the faces of the people coming out with this determined look and all I could think of was, we are about to have something really bad happen in these next weeks. So she got an idea. And now these thank you signs line neighborhoods and the fronts of hospitals. These people are on their way home. They're thinking about their kids. They've just dealt with the hospital. And I wanted to yell out, thank you so much for this. And I thought they'll think I'm crazy. The first order was 250 signs for $600. A message on nextdoor.com, Facebook for neighborhoods, spread the word. With an envelope for donations on her garage, the signs were gone in a flash. I took the seed money and ordered another thousand. And another thousand signs? Right, because one woman wanted 200 signs, another lady wanted 200 signs, and my friend in Lansing wanted 300 signs. She ended up with nearly a thousand dollars left over, so she called the Food Gatherers Food Bank in Washtenaw County. So I'm geeked. So I, I am geek too. So so you had enough to give the food bank a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars. And the responses? There would be those people saying, I was walking my dog this morning, I'm an ER nurse. It brought tears to my eyes, or my daughter's working in the Boston ICU and it just made my day. A small gesture of thanks that led to feeding others in need. We're in this together, this we're help, we're lifting, you know, they feel appreciated. They feel loved. They do feel loved, right? Just a little small sign. And now an Ann Arbor Councilwoman is taking that same sign and turning it into thank you to essential workers and passing it forward because we are all in this together. Just amazing what a small little thank you can do. And now it's helping the food bank. Great to see you, Glenda. Goes a long way. Oh, thank yeah. you so much, Carolyn.